Right now, let's meet uh, the man who won the marathon last year, Patrick Carroll, the red-headed Australian-born Irishman. A few times ago, I didn't go for a run, and, uh, and, and sort of about an hour or so later, you just, uh, you feel as if you really missed something, you know? It's just before 6 a.m., 23-year-old Patrick Carroll is on the road. He's winding down his final week's training in preparation for Sunday's Gold Coast Marathon. He's been averaging 170 kilometres a week. In 1982, he ran his first marathon on the Gold Coast and finished in 30th place. He missed the 83 and then won last year. His time of 2.23 was not overly exciting, but 25 minutes faster than his 1982 run. He's not fanatical about his diet, but he is careful. I don't eat a, a great deal of red meat, although uh, I, I, I eat a, uh, a, a fair amount of vegetables, and uh, although I, I suppose I can be talking the occasional pizza or, or a pancake or whatever. We managed to break into Patrick's training session for a brief chat about the marathon and one of his main competitors, Laurie Adams. Laurie and I have, um, have discussed it and uh, we've worked out a, a pace we're going to set out at and uh, if we can both stick at it, you know, well and good, but uh, it'll just be the best man on the day, I think. How important is mental toughness going to be this Sunday? You can get up to about, probably run up to about 30 kilometres and you're, and you're still running within yourself, more or less. But after then, you've really got to concentrate, and that's the uh, that's really the key to winning, I suppose. You know, the one who can who's mentally the more toughest. You know?